Today is an exciting day. Our van has landed home in Canada. Trinity has touched down. Hey, hands off, that's not even your van anymore. She is officially sold, as is our other van. Van life is over. <laughs> van life's not quite over yet. One last van life vlog. <laughs> We're here to pick up our camper van. Okay, sure, um, do you guys have the delivery order and then the arrival notice? Delivery order. Okay, perfect. And arrival notice. All right, let's roll. Thank you, sir. Have a great day. Very nice guy. Yeah, talk about service. I was up early this morning, had to get a stamp of approval at the Canadian import license, and the lady was very clear that I need to go get one of these, so I went to a thrift store, bought my new fit, feeling sporty, and then they just handed back one for free now, so. <laughs> Who wore it better? I think, I think it's clear. <laughs> Hello, pretty girl. <laughs> That's not even your van anymore. Didn't quite make it around the world, but she made it home. Wow. Even better shape than she's ever been. Yeah, she looks amazing. 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 Those amazing. new owners are so lucky. Yeah. This is ours, yeah. Okay. Yeah. I know, I got really lucky. I'll yeah. Fine. Yeah. Right. Yep. That's it. Yeah, you guys are free to go. Keys are in there. It's not cool. That is not cool. You open the door. Hi, baby girl. She stinks. Why does she stink? She's been at sea. This is huge. Our last trip in Trinity, we didn't unpack or make ourselves at home at all. So step one is a little cleanup. All the campus. It's really cool driving through all these people who are either out on an adventure, lots of European plates. Swiss, France, France. Netherlands, Deutschland. I remember this so well. We need air. <laughs> Again, in case you're wondering how we shipped our van from Europe to Canada, we wanted to thank Seabridge. They've made the entire process incredibly seamless. I mean, Amy and I suck at paperwork and organization, and here we are. Thanks, Seabridge. Bayers Road, laundromat. To ensure the overall success of this trip, the first thing we're going to do is clean the sheets. Musty? Yeah. Whoa, careful. Whoa, bro. Oh, Amen. Little hot box. <laughs> they haven't been washed in months. Maybe even years. <laughs> it's possible. <laughs> so you can only put bills in here? No card. And then what about the dryer that the it takes dryer. tokens to? Yes. What's your name? Linda. Linda, thank you very much, Linda. I'm Eamon. Yeah. All right, these are all very good tips. Wait, what? <laughs> and yeah, it's there. It's That's there. there, it just gets stuck. <laughs> Do you work here or are you no. just you're just amazing. Are all the East Coasters this polite and helpful? Yeah, that's right. We're that's good. right. <laughs> yeah, you guys are good. Yeah. You're putting the whole thing in there? Yeah. Should I not? Yeah. Well, you got lots of tokens. Yeah, no, I trust you for sure. <laughs> Linda knows best. So should I put, start putting stuff in now? Yeah, I think no. so. No? Oh, Linda. Linda's in charge. Oh, yeah. She's yeah. good now. I think we're good, Linda. I think we're going to go in. Yeah. Most fun I've ever had doing laundry <laughs> in my whole life. What is happening? Something else we didn't do last time was unpack. This time we must unpack. What do I use this for? It's so little. <laughs> I mean, that's my underwear. Oh yeah, that's what I. That's it. All right. Beautiful. <laughs> Linda sends her best. Uh, all put away, clean sheets. Shut it. it is quite hot and humid, and this fan doesn't want to turn on. I think might just be this. Okay, you want to test it, bud? <gasps> Amy Fitzgerald, you're amazing. Thank you, baby. There are three things that always stand out. When you're back in Halifax, number one, the cute houses. They are so cute. Number two, 
how friendly everyone is. Yeah, that's right. So friendly. And number three is the drivers. Like literally, you don't even need to put your turn signal on, you just start cruising into the lane and people slow down. Everyone's it's quite just nice. like, seems like they're not in a rush. It's so nice. Van life, we're back to it. We driving. Just want to paint a little picture on... Where Trinity's been? Yeah, where this camper van has been. We bought it <laughs> in 2017. 17. There it is. From a random dude before van life is what it is today and just went for it. We really didn't have a lot of resources online, but it has crazy to see just how far van life has gone. Some of these new build outs are and yeah, we bought this van, converted it to Celti, drove all the way around Canada, out east, then out west. Then we decided to go down to Mexico. We crossed into mainland Mexico. Our engine broke down. We drove back up to Texas, got a new motor, drove back down to Mexico, then went home. Then we went all the way to Baja, down Baja, <laughs> crossed the channel, back into Mexico, mainland, Drove up, drove all the way back out east, and shipped it over to Europe. You do the Europe thing. <laughs> the plan from there was to take Trinity around the world. We really did want to go around the world, but the pandemic stopped that. So we traveled through the UK, Ireland. We went down to Spain, through France. We went over to Morocco. We came back up through Italy. Can I, can I drive? Germany. It's a good spot. And it's just crazy that... We're now home. In, well, Halifax. But crazy. So we're gonna make the most of our last trip and we're gonna explore, people are calling it Canada's best kept secret. You'll decide. Um, <laughs> where are we going? Beautiful street. So cute. The last way I'm planning on making this the best van life trip ever is I've given us more time. So we're going to take the scenic route home. Eamon's not that excited about that. <laughs> it's not really the scenic route home. <laughs> it's like an extra couple days of a drive. <laughs> Oh my god, there's so many cars behind us, but what are we gonna do, Eamon? We're stupid. We are 50 cents short on this toll, and then they only take coins. I thought there was a man here. We tried throwing Mexican coins in there, but they won't take them. Where's my wallet? I have that. <laughs> Should I try again? No. Give me 50 cents. Come on. Oh my god. Come on. All right. Yeah, no. Go. Go. Oh, thank god. Sorry, Diane. That was so stressful. Jeez, I absolutely hated that. Here's a tip. Bring your change. Earlier, Eamon was saying that van life has really exploded since we started back in 2017. And something I've noticed since the last time we were in Halifax is all of the great places on Overlander or these apps we like to use seem to be closed. So I think when a lot of people stay at the same private land, enough of the owners are gonna say no more. Which means we are driving 15 kilometers on a dirt road to see if we can park somewhere kinda nice for the evening. Trinity can take it. Oh yeah. We hit the van life trifecta last night. This place was quiet, we parked flat, and the temperature was perfect. It's gonna be a good day. Mm -hmm. And we had clean sheets. Oh, the biggest bonus. Also, Ooh. come. We's in the forest. It's beautiful. Before we hit the road today, I just wanted to give you guys a little pregnancy update. 15 and a bit weeks and feeling really, really good. As many of you know, the beginning of my pregnancy was extra stressful because it was in the middle of a cancer reoccurrence scare. And at that time, I became extra grateful for my therapist who helped me really focus on the things that were within my control. So if you're going through a tough time or there is something that is interfering with your happiness, 
I couldn't recommend speaking to a therapist enough. And this is why I'm excited to introduce you to today's video sponsor, BetterHelp. BetterHelp's mission is to make therapy more affordable and more accessible, which is a really important mission because finding a great therapist can be really hard. And it's especially hard if you're limited to the people available within your area. BetterHelp makes this easier because it's done 100% online. You fill out a few questions about your needs and preferences in therapy and you can be matched with a therapist in just a few days. And because therapy is quite a lot like dating, if your first match isn't the right fit for you, you can switch therapists at any time for free, which I absolutely love. So if you're struggling or this is really calling to you, make sure you go to betterhelp.com slash Eamon and Beck to get 10% off your first month of therapy with BetterHelp. Buddy, what are you doing in the middle of the road? I love nature. Yesterday, Ammon alluded to the fact that we are going to Canada's best kept secret. In five minutes, we will welcome you to Cape Breton, which is at the eastern end of Nova Scotia and is constantly rated one of the best islands in all of North America. So we're excited to explore it. We're currently waiting for the bridge. It just had to rejig itself and open up so that the boat could cross through. Whoa. That is a cool piece of tech, no? Just for that little boat there. This is the ocean, right? Yeah. Cross through the ocean and then we'll be in Cape Breton. Just gonna wait for this bridge to turn. Any minute now. <laughs> Buddy, nobody's in a rush in Nova Scotia. You gotta adopt the Nova Scotian way of life. That's Tranquilo. Right. There you go. Thanks, buddy. Beach Road. Welcome to Inverness Beach. Our first stop on the Cabot Trail. I'm wondering if we need sweaters, actually. Sweaters? On the beach? It's supposed to be a beach day, mate. <laughs> I know. Just as I jinxed that we might need sweaters, the sun came out, so I was thinking we could, like, make the most of a little beach day and make a picnic, put on our bathing suits. It looks beautiful out now. Sandwich time. Don't mind if I do. Don't mind if I do again. Look, I know we sold these vans and this is genuinely our last van life excursion. So I don't know why I'm selling you on van life. Yum. But the absolute best part of living in a van is adaptability. I don't see anyone else bringing sandwiches to the beach. Exactly. You can have your home with you wherever you go. So if the sun does come out, you just go back, make your lunch, and head back down. Man, when you think of Canada, you don't think of like beaches like this, but this sand is so nice. You know what's also nice? is like, just like quickly jumping out of the van with just a couple items. Yeah. Imagine when we have a baby here, like you need to bring like... Oof. Oof. Like what do you even bring? A stroller? <laughs> you can just carry it. Sunscreen. Sunscreen. You know, you want to be sun safe. Yeah. That'd be baby. Nice picnic. Nice simple picnic. Oh, we got ourselves a sandwich, mate. And then the kid will be like, oh, I want the sandwich. They're like, shut okay. up kid, we're having a sandwich. <laughs> I also would love it here, wouldn't you? Mm. Mm. It's hitting, eh? This is such a nice moment. Basically living my dream day. Beck is always giving herself a hard time about these chemo curls. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to convince her just to own it. And really embrace it. looks awesome. Blow up the comments. Like, <laughs> keep it curly. It's so sick. You look like a 70s rocker. Also, bump date. I can push it out, <laughs> but that's kind of what it sits like. Very cute. <laughs> I'm going for a swim. You coming, buddy? 
I don't know my bathing suit. So? Luxury. God, van life's awesome. I am so glad we are doing the scenic route home. I feel like I'm completely in love with van life all over again. What? I am. I love it. And that was just like the perfect day. Crossing over the bridge. The sun came out. It's just, and it's just not going to stop there. So we're going to do one of the world's best hikes at sunset. But we're also playing a game. Are we though? Truth or dare? No, you're Long gonna time. dare me to do the craziest things. I don't want to play with you. I don't want to play with you. I don't want to play with you. your comfort zone today, baby. Okay, it's the last day of van life. Stay why not? Stay tuned, everybody. We'll see what Beck gets up to. Clothing optional. No, clothing is not. You want half my peach? No, but you enjoy it. It's really good. My friend's got a girlfriend and she hates that. She tells me. Every day. Is this taste off? I, I, I think that's really off. Is that yeah. bad? Is that it, bad? It tastes weird. We ate this on our sandwiches today. I see blue skies. Red rainbows too. <laughs> Is that the one? I don't even know if my line was right. <laughs> we are children. Children, Children of, of the night. No, light. Uh -uh. Just going to get a scrub brush. Oh, I need my wallet. That'll help, eh? I need my wallet or some kind of money. <laughs> I have no self control. You I did see it. sugar and I just. No, you didn't. Ugh. <laughs> Candy time. Buddy, what are you buying? They look so good. Jolly Rancher gummies. Oh my gosh, sour? <gasps> you can't even have self Amen. Mm, mm, mm. Charlie. This is what's going on in my head right now. Look at the sign. Boom, 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 boom. Pulling in. I dare you to go put a aim and a Beck sticker on the guy back. Oh the my god, we're not playing truth or dare yet. Come on, go. No. I'm too much of a baby. Like, I don't know what you want me to tell you. I'm just not that kind of person. Hello, Hi. Hi. We're going to the Skyline Trail, right? 20 minutes away. And okay. Pass. Yes. Yep. So for two people? Yes, yes please. please. And this is the park map. Have a nice day. Okay, bye bye. Bye bye. Au revoir. Au revoir. <laughs> okay, we're in! Welcome to Cape Breton Highlands. I believe this is a national park of Canada. 26 hiking trails, beaches, picnic areas, public washrooms. Beautiful, beautiful. I've always been somewhat of a sucker for a nice viewpoint and this drive has been amazing today. I just feel like today is reigniting my love of travel. Yet we're in our own backyard. Oh, Canada, eh? This old fart doesn't even get out of the driver's seat. It's a nice view. It's beautiful. Yeah. You're such a grandpa. <laughs> wow, that's stunning. Is that what we're about to go see? Yep. It's a good thing one of us is a rule follower. Eamon didn't think we needed a park pass. I think I could have <laughs> given him five bucks. <laughs> Rural follower Beck winning today. Oh, it's really sick, man. Yeah. My 
That was so dude. I drew the oh my god. If you're gonna take a nap, 45 minutes, no longer. Sue's over here working her tail off. I'm just working on the water. Chef is literally just passing me things to do. <laughs> <laughs> Dinner tonight is sure to be a winner. We've got Asian noodles all the way from Thailand, only like a few months old. Then we've got fresh broccoli just a couple days ago, mixed with tofu and carrot. But the real winner is gonna be the sauce. We've got a soya sauce, which probably looks like it was from the UK. A sriracha. Now here's the Moroccan honey. This was actually found in some of the Egyptian tombs. And a thing of garlic that was kind of a brick, so we had to chip away at that. So yeah, should be an interesting flavor. And um, bon appetit. Thank you, baby. Thank you. Enjoy. Looks good. Ready? <laughs> <laughs> It's been a while since you dragged me on a hike. Ha 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 ha. Ha ha ha. You're this gonna have fun with This has right been there. one of the top rated things to do. So stay tuned. I'm gonna dare Beck to do some uncomfortable things and it's gonna be great. I'm not doing them. Are the bugs pretty bad? Yeah. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh no. I'm wondering if I should put on pants, honestly. Oh, frig. It's really weird if I say hi to you guys. No, no hi. Hi. Oh, all the time. Oh, right on. Do you have any bug spray? We have some right there. Go, Brooke, go! Brooke, would you mind if I spray myself down? Well, I'll give you the good stuff. Well, I don't know if you know I'm pregnant, so family friendly? Yeah, maybe. I I'll do know you're pregnant. Congratulations! <laughs> thank you! Thank you want the meat? Well, maybe, yeah. Amazing. You're honestly the best. Thank you so much. Have a great trip. Have a great trip. Bye, Bye guys. Brooke. Coming to the rescue. Thank you very much. That was my big dare. I dared Brooke to ask about the you didn't, No, it so. doesn't count. Time cut. Does not count. Should we join the tour? There we go. That's uncomfortable. Ask the tour guide a question. I dare you to try and interrupt the tour. No. And pitch yourself as a better tour guide. No, amen. Yeah. I'm not half playing the this price. dare thing, honestly. So we go up. It looks like it's literally a loop and we can't miss it. 8.2 kilometers, two to three hours. No, no dogs. Oso? Sorry, Os. Let's cut to a shot of Oso and Bob at the cabin. Okay. Good boy, Oso. Don't judge us on the quality of the shot, Bob. <laughs> Have you guys seen that TikTok where the guys like POV every white person while hiking? <laughs> so Amy and I are on this park and we're just going. Can't carry the backpack because he's got a broken back, but. Hmm. Okay. Bort, Bort, Bort we're getting too old for that. <laughs> Definitely starting to get why this is called the best kept secret. It is underrated and super quiet. Like, I don't know if we're even going the right way, but we're the only ones here. <laughs> we just passed our first couple and two little boys. And they were saying there's a moose up here just past the boardwalk. That's literally what I said to Beck before we started the hike is nothing would make this day better than seeing a moose. Neither of us, a couple of canooks, never, ain't, ain't never seen no moose no, before. No, we've never seen one. I don't, I don't wanna like, come on, could she seriously still be there? Let's be quiet, be quiet. <laughs> I thought we were being quiet. That Moroccan ginger garlic, I think. Oh, my poor tummy. Are you so high about life? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Come on, that was. It's so weird because you were talking so about- So sick. You were just talking about seeing one. And I'm like, yeah, right, Amy, I'm sorry. You're not gonna see a moose. Cape Breton, baby. Cape Breton? Go to Cape Breton. I love the vlog, too. Of all the hikes I've taken you on, what do you rate this? It's got, I mean, a moose at the top? That's almost fake. 
Yeah, this is amazing. This is amazing. Turns out it wasn't a total waste of money. <laughs> Make sure that moose doesn't bonk into me. Good morning. Unfortunately, our time here on the Cape is coming to an end. We are going to drive the 1800 kilometers home. If we had more time, there's definitely more time. There's more time. There's lots more to explore and see and do and discover. But we got a bear who's waiting for us. We're coming for yos. Try to make it home in two days. Makes a car sick, tired, and really hot. I am so excited to see Osa. We're suckers. See you soon, buddy. Stay tuned. We're gonna see the big boy. Oh my God. Do you want me to say hi to the vlog? Hi. We're less than an hour from the cabin, and I just wanted to say thanks to Van Life for all of the amazing gifts it's given us. So as much as we're ready to move on, I'm so grateful. Cheers, baby. Cheers. Oh. Oh. Hi. 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 Hey, Lucilla, we love you. Yes. <laughs>